Hi, my name is Eddie. I'm CEO, and we switch from Hive to Asana. For more reviews like this, click below. The business problems that both Hive and Asana solve are within project management, meaning that what tasks do you delegate, how much detail do you provide on those tasks, what is the timeline that you provide on those tasks, who is accountable for what and when. And there are a number of software products within this area, but Hive and Asana are the market leaders. Specifically, Asana is best because I feel like it is the simpler product to use. It is easy to put down as a to-do list, but then you can get as extensive as you would like, adding as much detail, meta tags, uh, descriptions, and files. So it can go from simple to complex very easily, whereas with Hive, it requires a lot of data up front, and it just can have a lot of different moving parts, when, even when it's not necessary. What Hive is best for is when managing complex projects with multiple stakeholders, numerous large teams, and a lot of moving pieces with a number of critical dependencies and steps. So at a very large enterprise level, I think Hive is a fantastic solution. Both Hive and Asana were very easy to get started with, but I would say Asana was easier to get started with. Asana is not only more familiar for most people, but it's not just the familiarity, but it's also because you can start as simple as a to-do list, whereas with Hive requires a little bit of a more of a learning curve and requires a little bit more data up front. Um, so outside of just familiarity, it's just I think Hive requires a little bit more getting used to. The top considerations from evaluating this type of software is both simplicity as well as speed and the amount of managing the number of tasks simultaneously. So entering and managing these projects is extremely complex and having the ability to keep it as simple as possible is critically important. So I actually think Asana is better at this than Hive and being able to handle the complexities without and the dependencies can mean a ton of money uh, when timelines are missed. So these products fill a very important category, uh, which is uh, why there's so many products in this space.